Hi everybody and welcome back to Tea of Some Blossoms. My name is Rebecca and today I'm going to be reviewing Sweet Dreams from David's Tea. Now, I'm reviewing this tea because we are almost to Christmas time and when it gets to Christmas time I get like super excited and like freaking out-ish and I can't sleep because I'm just like Christmas! So I thought if anybody else is having trouble sleeping just in general or who wants good night's sleep specifically for Christmas Eve that you know this might be a good option. <laughs> so I'm going to show you something. So usually when you order 2 ounces or 50 grams of tea from David's Tea, it comes in a package like this. You know, pretty nice size package. But when I ordered Sweet Dreams, this is the package it came in. Do you see? Look at that! It's not only thick, but it's also wide and tall and like it's so much bigger. There's so much tea in this. And I think that's because it's very light and airy because there's chamomile and fennel in this. But, so, I got so much tea. Let's hope I like it. So, I have some tea brewing right here. So while we're waiting on that, we're going to smell it. And it smells very fennel-y and lemony. I smell a lot of fennel and lemon. I smell a little bit of the chamomile. Yeah, I see a lot of fennel and a lot of chamomile in this. Jeez. Okay, so the description of this tea is Enjoy a midnight treat with this delicious soothing blend of chamomile, lemongrass, fennel, hibiscus, citrus, licorice, and rose petals. So the ingredients of this tea are, it's all organic. It's organic lemongrass, chamomile, hibiscus, licorice root, lemon peel, orange peel, lemon myrtle, fennel seeds, rose petals, and lemon and orange flavoring. So it's an herbal tea. Did I already say that? I don't actually know if I said that. It's an herbal tea. And I'm kind of excited to try this. I don't really like fennel and lemon teas are maybe not my thing, but I've gotten so many recommendations about this tea, so I'm going to try it. And I think I'm going to like it. Maybe. We'll see. Right now. Ready? Ready? David's tea mug. Shout out. Chamomile, fennel, lemon. That's like the top three things I taste. You get like the nice chamomile and in like the back of your tongue, like the aftertaste, you kind of have that like spiciness from the fennel. Hmm. It's making my belly all nice and warm. So I appreciate that. And the chamomile is relaxing on its own. I grew up drinking chamomile tea whenever I was sick or when I just wanted a cup of tea. Like my mom would always give me chamomile. And so whenever I like smell chamomile, like I'm more like, oh, getting a little drowsy there. But the lemon in it kind of wakes up my mouth. And it leaves sort of a really refreshing feeling to it, which isn't a bad thing at all. So I'd probably more drink this on like a rainy afternoon like it is now. Just like, you know, cozied up, wanting to relax, maybe a Sunday or a Saturday afternoon. But I don't know if I drink it right before bed because I don't want that lemony like waking me up more than I want. Like, I don't know. I don't want to be woken up by lemon. But it's very good. Yep, I would say it's a chamomile and fennel tea with like a squirt of lemon juice in it. That's what it tastes like. I'm not going to pass this tea on quite yet. I was thinking that if I don't like it, I'm just going to pass it on to my mom who loves these types of teas. But I think I'm going to keep it. I'm going to drink it for a few more days and see how it goes. And then I'll probably get rid of it. Like, there is no way. I don't love it enough to drink all of this tea. There's so much of it. I hope this review has been helpful for you guys. How, do you drink this tea? Like, what is your favorite? Or, like, what are your favorites, like, sleepy time teas. Um, I hope you guys are having an amazing day full of tea and happiness and I will see you in the next video. Bye!